Indigenous rights in the Pacific Islands have been a long-standing issue for centuries. The region is home to many distinct and diverse cultures. And the rights of these cultures have been a constant source of contention and debate. From the colonization of the region by European powers to the present day. Indigenous rights have been a major point of contention. The Pacific Islands are home to many distinct indigenous cultures, including those of the Polynesian, Micronesian, and Melanesian peoples. Each of these cultures has its own unique history and customs as the region has been colonized. Many of these customs have been lost or changed. In many cases, the indigenous people of the Pacific Islands have faced discrimination and marginalization leading to the loss of land and resources. In recent years, there has been an increased focus on indigenous rights in the Pacific Islands. In particular, the United Nations Declaration on the Rights of Indigenous Peoples, UNDRIP, has been used as a tool to recognize and protect the rights of indigenous peoples in the region. This declaration has been adopted by many countries in the Pacific including Australia, New Zealand, and Fiji. In particular, the declaration calls for the recognition of the distinct cultures and languages of indigenous peoples. It also calls for the protection of their land and resources, and for their right to self-determination. This has been a major point of contention in the region. As many of the indigenous peoples of the Pacific Islands have had their land and resources taken away without their consent. In addition, the declaration also calls for the respect of indigenous peoples' rights to maintain and develop the traditional cultures, practices, and institutions. This includes the right to maintain their languages and cultural practices as well as the right to practice the traditional religions. The UNDRIP has been a major step forward in protecting indigenous rights in the Pacific Islands. However, there is still much work to be done in order to ensure that indigenous peoples in the region are able to fully enjoy their rights and have access to the resources they need. In particular, the need for legal recognition of indigenous rights is still a major issue in many parts of the region. In conclusion, indigenous rights in the Pacific Islands is an ongoing issue that needs to be addressed. The UNDRIP has been a major step forward in recognizing and protecting the rights of indigenous peoples in the region. But much more needs to be done. Indigenous peoples need to be given legal recognition and access to their traditional lands and resources. It is only then that they can fully enjoy their rights and live a life of dignity.